You're a nurse on a busy medical floor and you have four patients, but you can only see one first. Who do you choose? This is exactly what the NCLEX tests in prioritization questions, and today, we are breaking it down using ABC's and Maslow's hierarchy of needs. Here is the scenario. Patient 1 is a patient with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease who is due for a nebulizer. Patient 2 is a patient with a deep vein thrombosis, who has new shortness of breath. Patient 3 is a diabetic patient needing insulin. Patient 4 is a patient with a pressure ulcer who needs a dressing change. The key to solving this is to think like a nurse. Use ABCs first, airway, breathing, circulation, and then Maslow's hierarchy. Physical survival always comes before anything else. Patient 2 has a deep vein thrombosis and new shortness of breath. This is a red flag for a pulmonary embolism, which is a life-threatening emergency that could block oxygen supply. This patient comes first. Maslow's hierarchy tells us that physiological needs like oxygen, circulation and safety must be met before psychological needs or routine care. So the correct prioritization is first patient 2 who has a life-threatening concern, second patient 1 who needs breathing support, third patient 3 who needs insulin, fourth patient 4 who is stable and requires routine care. Remember, ABCs, Maslow and critical thinking that is your NCLEX prioritization formula. Want more NCLEX tips, case studies, and quick reviews? Go to Canadian Nurse Expert and let us pass that exam together. Credits, script by Canadian Nurse Expert.